A certain aeroplane can cover a distance of 5000 kilometers traveling over a time t hours with a velocity of 5000 over t. Okay, so what is it saying? You've got a plane which travels 5000 kilometers uh, and the velocity is uh, velocity is uh, speed is distance over time. If the same plane flew the same 5000 kilometers again this time increasing its speed by 250 meters so velocity has become v plus 250 and cutting the time by t minus 1 by 1 hour so what is the speed so let's say the speed of the plane uh, to start with okay so let's say the speed of the plane is x so you you should know speed is distance over time is distance over time. So we can say <coughs> uh, x speed, the first time the speed is uh, is 5000 over t. That's already given. Okay, uh, 5000 over t. So, so this is for the one journey. And then if you're increasing the speed, the new speed is x plus 250 and the time is d reduced by 1 so when the speed is increasing by 250 you reduce 1 you need 1 less hour so this is 5000 divided by t minus 1 now we want to make we want to find x not t so we're going to make t, we are going to make t the subject so if you make t the subject here can I write t is going to be 5000 over x. So from this equation we get t is equal to 5000 over x and if you make if you if from this equation can I write t minus 1 is equal to 5000 over x plus 250. So again if you make t the subject here you can write t is equal to 5000 over x plus 250 plus 1. So this is equation 2 and this is equation 1. So let's say this is equation 2 and this is equation 1. So what can we do with equation 1 and equation 2? Well, we can say, well, equation 2 is in terms of t equation equation 1 is in terms of t and equation 2 is also in terms of t so from 1 and 2 we can say 5000 over x is equal to 5000 over x plus x plus 250 plus 1 okay so now what can we do? We have to just solve this equation. So what can we do? We are let's multiply. Okay, so what can we do? I want to cancel this x and x plus 250 in the denominator. So what we're going to do is we're going to multiply everything by x times x plus 250. So x times x plus 250. Okay and I'm going to multiply also this by so I'll use a green pen times 5000 over x hmm? so let me use a green color so I'll again write here 5000 over x plus 250 250 and plus one. So we're going to multiply this by x times x plus 250 and also this by x times x plus 250. So the reason I multiplied this whole thing, each of the terms, so this is one, this is one. So I multiplied 
5000 over x by x times x plus 50. I multiplied this by x plus 50. I multiplied this expression by x times x plus 250 and 1 by x times x plus 250. So what will happen? So well we can say this x can be cancelled by this x. So this and this gets cancelled. What happens here? This is x plus 250 here will get cancelled with this and nothing gets cancelled here. So finally we can get what are we getting here? So this is you can do the rest yourself. Pause the video and try to do it yourself. So x plus 250 times 5000 is equal to this is going to be this is going to be x times 5000 plus this is going to be x times x plus 250 which is going to be x squared plus 250x okay so let's solve this so if you expand this so this is how much 5000x this is 5000x plus 5000 times 250 which is 25 times 5 is 125 and you have to put four zeros one two three four which is equal to 5000x plus x squared plus 250x so this and this gets cancelled you got 5000x on both sides so now this becomes a quadratic equation we can move this to the other side so we can say 0 is equal to this is 250x so we can say x squared plus 250x minus 125 with four zeros now you can use a calculator to solve this so go to equations so this is your graphic calculator go to equations and it is a polynomial second degree polynomial enter 1 250 and minus 125 after four zeros one two three four enter and then you solve it so the two x's is 1000 and 1000 minus 1250 so we can say x is 1000 or x is minus 1250 but x is the speed okay so you can say x has to be greater than 0 because x is the speed of the plane so you can say the speed of the plane speed of the plane is 1000 kilometers per hour 1000 kilometers per hour so let's understand check whether the answer makes sense so what are we saying if the plane has 1000 the speed of 1000 this will take how many hours this will take 5 hours okay 5000 divided by 1000 is 5 and this would be if you use this equation when it's increasing the speed by 250 so here the time would be uh, it'll here the here the equation will be 5000 speed speed is distance over time or time time is distance over speed so this is time is distance over speed which is 1250 that is going to be four hours and it does make sense when you're increasing the speed by 250 kilometers you're reducing the time by one hour